100 meters to the line then, and it's going to be Koshevoy who's going to honor his sponsors go out. He's going to try and take the points. Tekla Hymanet's there though, has to sprint on him, and it is Daniel Tekla Hymanet who wins his second intermediate sprint of the day and takes three more bonus seconds again. <laughs> So then, this is the standings in the points. Tekla Hyman at 72, having got out there with the intermediate sprints. Pustelberger on 50 for the stage win. Caleb Ewan down on 35. Now, whether Tekla Hyman or not is going to take the jersey, it all depends on who's up there in the end today. And, and if we have a bit of a sprint and Caleb Ewan gets there, you put money on him to take some points, maybe enough to beat Daniel Tekla Hyman. But Tekla Hyman has put himself within a good shout winning those intermediate sprints yesterday and today. 50 points available for the victory today. So there's only one, two, three riders who can go out and beat him. Those three riders are the riders we saw yesterday. Ewan, Jupa, Bustelberger has already got it. Actually, Andre Greipel as well, no four riders. A good ride from Daniel Tekla Hyman. He's just really trying to get some jersey for his team.
stamina at the saddle first of all settles into a position and once again he's going to close the Russian down. Tekla Heimer looking head and shoulders above the rest. Yes, he, he, he certainly looks very impressive there and uh, he's just closing the guys down and trying to get to this mountain classification point and then that'll be the job done for today. That's 23 It'd be heartbreak again for Tekla Heimer if he's not able to get the jersey from this now. Yes, well, I think uh, looking at the way he's riding, you know, he is uh, much stronger than the other two riders as are with him at the moment. And, uh, you know, he just needs to try and keep this rolling along. He has to do a bit more of the work as we come to uh, kilometres of the summit here. But, yeah, he's playing safe. He, you know, just marking the other riders a lot. And uh, 20 seconds at the moment uh, should be sufficient to make it to this uh, GPM point. Yeah, and there's movement behind. So, Bardiani taking movement behind. Only sort of semblance of drama we've had so far today. We're at a thousand meters for the first time in the Giro d'Italia. They climb up to Gienna Silana. And I'm looking for a reaction behind from the blue jersey, the king of the mountains. Are oh, they going to be caught before the top, though? It certainly looks as they are. Heartbreak, it seems, for Daniel Tekleheimer, who's following the wheel now of Shalanov, sprinting out there himself, the pink jersey behind as well. He's going up and pulling out behind to stop other riders, getting points for his teammate Tekleheimer with 150 metres to go. It looks as though he's going to go out and get 15 points. 175 for Tekleheimer, who's giving it his all to the top here. And Tekleheimer goes to take 15 points now. Is it good enough for the King of the Mountains jersey? Yes, it is. Tekla Hyman that goes into blue, and it's Malia Zurra, and a reward for two days of really hard work there for Dimension Data, and Daniel Tekla Hyman. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a great day again. After yesterday, we are working really very deep, so it works today so I was so, so happy to be in this podium in this 100 edition so it's, it's really great for me and the team.